Okay, the last couple links are the semester schedule, but we've already talked about that several times. And then there's two videos. I'm not going to play them because I think they'll have copyright issues on YouTube. But they basically talk about what is Photoshop used for, and it shows you some cool things that you can use Photoshop for. Hello, my name is Paul. And I wanna... You do not need to take notes on these videos. You do not need to do what they're doing in the video. I just want you to kind of get an idea of what Photoshop is going to do this semester and um, some of the things that we're going to learn throughout the semester. So kind of just watch them and absorb them as you're watching them, but you do not have to like memorize them or, or follow along and do everything that the, 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 um, the authors of the video are doing. Okay, that will wrap up module one, all the required activities. After you do that, it should only take you maybe 20 minutes to complete the required submissions. They're an initial response, a profile picture, introduce yourself, and a syllabus quiz. Now, the in an initial response is um, a submission that only I'm going to see, and you have two options for the submission. You can respond and say, I'm comfortable navigating the course. I've watched all your videos. I feel very confident that I will be able to get to the things I need to get to and submit the things I need to submit, and I'll get them in on time. Or maybe you're still confused and you just don't understand yet, and you and there's just there's a lot to learn, right? Because every online class is different, so you have to figure out how each teacher wants you to navigate. If that's the case, you're going to say, I'm not comfortable and I don't understand. But you're not going to stop there. You're going to say, I have specific questions and list all of your questions. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that I check that initial response activity multiple times per day for like the first 10 days of the semester so that as soon as you submit a question, you get the, the fastest, quickest response possible. Now, if you don't want to ask your questions in the initial response, if you want to wait to submit that, you can always come to my office hours every Monday, Wednesday, Friday from 8 to 9 a.m. via the chat tab, and we, I can answer your questions in real time. The profile picture is just that. I would like you to upload a profile picture. I would like it to be you. I would like it to be a zoomed-in picture of your face so I can actually see how it is. See how small the picture is? It's hard to tell who that per person is from a distance right now. If you're in a group shot and you're far away from the camera, I will not be able to see it. Please just post a picture of yourself with a zoomed up picture of your face. There's an introduce yourself activity. It's a discussion thread and I just want you to take a few minutes to introduce yourself to your classmates. This course is going to be a community. Everything that you submit is going to be in a discussion thread so you can show everyone else what you're working on. It's not going to be discussions like you might have in your other classes where the teacher tells you that you have to respond in a minimum of three paragraphs and each paragraph must have seven sentences and your total post must have a minimum of a hundred words and then after you're done you have to reply to three of your classmates and you must use two paragraphs and it's not that type of discussion it's a discussion in the sense that I want you to be able to see what everyone else is working on and if you really like it you can say hey I really like that great job and you can encourage each other you can ask each other questions um, because the more you interact with your peers, the more you're actually going to learn in our class. And so the introduce yourself activity is really your test for the discussion thread. So I want you to type a few paragraphs and I want you to try to embed a picture and, and practice in there so that when it gets time to have your actual real coursework for modules two through six, you can submit them on time and you don't have to email me at 11.50 on Saturday night and say you can't figure out how to embed your picture. So this is kind of your test for that to make sure it works. There's also a syllabus quiz. It has multiple choice questions. It has unlimited attempts and you should know the answers if you read the syllabus. If not, go look up the answers. They are certain things that are very important to me and to the college and I have to know that you know what the late policy is and, and what grade you need to earn an A so that I know that you're aware of those expectations. And so I would like you to take the syllabus quiz as many times as is necessary to earn 100%. When you're done that, you can move on to Module 2 by clicking on Module 2.